What is going on YouTube? This is Nick with Hilltop TCG back in with another video and today is part two of the Evolution GX versus VMAX battle. Today we're going to be doing Jolteon. Let's go. Oh baby. Are you kidding me? Zekrom. Oh baby. You missed it Jack. This is not real. Oh my gosh! What? Hi. <laughs> oh gosh, that's my face. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what is going on, Hilltop TCG family? That's right. Today, we're going to be doing part two Jolteon battle. So, we're doing the GX and the VMAX Jolteon premium collection boxes. I guess the GX is a special collection box. But, yeah, let's get on to the cards, you guys. So, part two, part one, we did Flareon and the VMAX crushed it. That's all I gotta say. Go check out the video if you're curious. Flareon crushed it in the last one. So I was noticing this as I was holding it. Look at the size difference. So there we go. It's even a skinnier box. And look at this. I mean, we got a whole almost like two inches of like space. This is actually pretty open on both of these. That's interesting. Uh, is this side the same? Uh, no, this side's actually pretty good. Anyways, that's concerning a little bit, but we had good pulls on the last one, so it's fine. Um, yeah, what am I what am I talking about? Let's uh let's get into the GX. Let's stay on trend. Let's keep doing. Let's start out with the GX. Before we get too far into the video, you guys, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to us here on YouTube. Don't forget to hit the little bell to get notified each time we do post a video, you guys. It really truly does mean a lot and it goes a long way for the channel and helps us out truly. So, go do that. So, you know what? No, let's let's keep with the GX. I was going to switch it up. Let's go GX first. Let's talk about financials. I talked about it a lot in the last video, probably for too long, because I always do. But basically, I spent $90 a piece on these boxes. Uh, back in the day, 40 bucks. Uh, Value-wise, it's around 80 to 82 bucks in these packs, jumbo, uh, promo cards. It's about an 80 to $82 value. So you're about getting your value. It's when you open the packs is when you kind of lose your chance of making your money back unless you get a big banger. But I want to compare the two. I want to see how the how the boxes have evolved over the last two years. I want to see how the hits are. Let's see who can take the W. Last time, the Flareon VMAX definitely won. Let's see if one of these GX boxes can totally win. All right, let's get this bad boy open. There we go. All right. There is the box. Get out of here. All right, promos. Oh man, they just drop right out too. Like I love, I mean, if you guys remember back in the day, man, these things were like pinned in, um, definitely were hard to get out. This is the larger size jumbo card. Two promos, I mean, the alternate art promos are so much cooler. I mean, these are cool, but there's no texture, they're shiny. But definitely Pokemon has stepped it up in that front. Pack-wise though, you guys, packs, my gosh. Insane pack selection here, you guys. Insane pack selection. We have Celestial Storm, Evolutions, Two Lost Thunder, and Guardians Rising, you guys. Um, basically $60 in pack value right there, right off the start. Um, these packs are, are not cheap going out and buying by and by themselves and we're gonna rip into them today so what what did we do last time we probably did yeah we did we did guardian rising celestial storm lost thunder lost storm thunder and evolutions so what i preached in the last video again you guys is pokemon has to change the ratios like it's super fun ripping old school packs but man if you're paying 10 plus dollars don't, I mean, don't get your hopes up, right? Like, it's gonna be fun to see and take the chance, but the ratios haven't changed, right? Like, one, one in five, one in six packs, you're gonna you're gonna get some type of hit, and that's the reality of it, and right there, we didn't get one. So, if you're going out and spending big money on this stuff, hopefully you have an expectation of like, hey, this is fun, we're doing it for fun, that's what I'm doing right now, right? I wanna have fun, I wanna review the two very similar products several years apart just to see how they've evolved how they've changed um and yeah so there i mean i'm through i'm through geez what 18 dollars worth of pack so far <laughs> all right can we get something i see a little bit of shine oh baby come on 
Hey, Suicune GX. Full art. Let's go, Lost Thunder. Let's freaking go. Yes. So that is a great start for the GX box, you guys. A full art out of five packs. That is a great, great start. Can we get lucky in the last two, you guys? Can we get lucky? A Smeagol. Nothing there. That's totally fine. Code card for you. All right, evolutions. I mean, this is what everybody hopes for now, right? Reverses can be just as cool. We can get that banger Charizard. Um, let's see. All right, green code card. So it doesn't matter. We're hunting for the reverse. Oh, we got red. We got red, you guys. We got the red. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, Ponyta. Dang it, man. B drill right there for the regular rare. We got the reverse Ponyta. Oh, we got an Imakuni right there for a secret rare. Not bad, not bad. You can get the secret rare in the uncommon spot. Dude, I saw the red, man, and I got so stoked. All right, so Jolteon had the Suicune full art. Now let's get on to the new, more modern set. I mean, look at the two alt arts, you guys. And you get a pin, and you get six packs instead of five packs. Basically for the same amount, if you're thinking just MSRP, right? I mean, these ones you can get actually for cheaper than the GX boxes right now. Um, obviously insane you guys I think these are on average around 50 bucks a piece right now um, definitely definitely a lot harder to open than the other ones that's fine definitely Pokemon has stepped up their glue definitely stepped up their glue there we go and there it is we got her open they have stepped up their glue all right so let's get all this out on here man I mean come on I want I want that Suicune to take the W. I want I want one GX box to win. I mean I want them all. I want all I want I want all the GX boxes to win. What am I talking about? I mean good little tabs in here for these you guys. I mean it's a pain to kind of get the tabs done, but you know your cards are just gonna maybe fall right out and be in fantastic con condition compared to some of the previous years. There's the Jolteon jumbo. Here are both the alt art, I mean promos, you guys. Textured, textured promos. Pokemon heard the fans and they said, all right, we want to step it up for you guys. Absolutely, I think are crushing it right now with their collection boxes. Keep it up, Pokemon. Keep it up. All right, so what do we got? Here's a code card. You guys go, hopefully one of you guys can go snag the awesome alt art promos in here. So we get six packs instead of five again. Uh, I mean, pack value wise, they're all around all around three, you know, three, four, five bucks, right? Um, I mean, Rebel Clash is cool to see. Vivid Voltage is is cool to see, right? Evolving Skies is obviously the really one that you want. Go watch the last video. We pulled a banger out of the last Evolving Skies box, an absolute banger. All right, Suicune, can you withstand six packs of the V Max boxes? Can you withstand? All right, we got a Hollow. Hatterene Hollow right there. Again, as I'm ripping into this, you guys, don't forget the giveaway in the description. It's a, it's through Gleam, giving away Brilliant Stars goodness. Um, and don't forget the giveaway video that we got going on right now for the uh, Pikachu V Union Playmat Collection Box from Target. It's not focusing. There we go. All right. So I'm cool not getting hits in those because I'd rather have an Infusion Strike, Vivid, or Evolving Skies. Let's save our luck for down the road. Hey, Flareon. Flareon right there. Would have been fitting out of the Flareon stuff, but it's not. We're doing Jolteon. All right. Can we see a hit? And I mean, they're not going to juice these up, guys. I mean, they're not juicing up the hits. You're getting two alt arts right off the freaking bat, right? I mean, what, I mean, what else can you ask for? I mean, come on. But I'd love to see a banger. We got one last time. Can we do it again? And, oh, it's just a V, it's sticking. Like, like oh, there we go, I slid it. There we go, Greninja V. For some reason, how I open packs, they love, the regular Vs love to stick. The full art slide right across like butter, but not the Vs. All right, so last pack magic. GX boxes for Jolteon are definitely winning right now. Can we go two for two and have a banger out of Evolving Skies? Come on, baby. 
and Eevee, fitting, and a Thievul. All right, so part two, Jolteon definitely took the W, guys. Part two, Jolteon took the W with a Suicune GX box, you guys, or Pat, or full, wow, full art. Dope card, you guys. Super cool. Um, yeah, uh, hands down, GX box one on this one. Uh, but yeah, if you guys made it to the end of this video, absolute legend. Don't forget all the giveaway fun stuff we got going on right now. But have a great night, weekend, whatever it is for you. Peace.